Hey guys, Original Boris here. Uh, back again for another DVD buys. I've only picked up two. Actually, I picked up a lot more, but uh, I have to go through my DVDs because they've kind of gotten mixed up uh, with my older ones. The kids were looking through them. But uh, we have a store called Hastings. It is a national store, and they are currently going out of business. Uh, not the whole chain, but they are closing a bunch of the stores down. Uh, it's nationwide. Uh, from what I read, they were having trouble keeping up with, uh, you know, the competition with uh, Redbox and Netflix and DVDs and Blu-rays. They are just not selling as well as they used to, as they used to, because of uh, internet and Netflix and everything being so easy, easy to watch nowadays online. Not many people are buying DVDs. But people like me still do. The store is called Hastings. The one here in Walla Walla, Washington, it's closing. So I went there. Uh, I bought these last week. I do plan on going again. And I heard the DVDs are a lot cheaper now from what I've been told. So I plan on picking up a lot more. But for now, I only picked up two. They close on September 10th, 2013. So I better go soon. Last time I went last week, uh, the store was looking like it was getting pretty cleared out. So everything's for sale. So when I go, we'll see what we have left. But, if not, then, you know, it just didn't work out. But anyway, picked up two of them. This first one is a cartoon. It's a Spanish cartoon. Uh, it does not have the original case, but that's okay. I only paid 99 cents for this. And I bought this for my daughter. She's starting a, uh, her Mexican bilingual class. So I bought her a Spanish cartoon. Uh, I'll show you what it is. It's called uh, El Chavo. El Chavo is a television series, uh, a comedian. And I did not know that they had a cartoon, but this is the El Chavo cartoon. Uh, volume 3, this is the only one I found, but, you know, that's okay. She doesn't know. She's still she's still young, and she, she doesn't really care about the volumes. So I, I picked her up this one, but as you can see, it doesn't have the original case. But it does have the Hastings uh, paper here. So let's go ahead and open that up, and I'll show you. Whoops. Drop something. I'll show you what that's all about. Open it up. This is the case. So you can see it's for two DVDs, but it only has one in here. And this is it right here. The Chavo cartoon. It says right here, Volume 3, and it's got the Hastings sticker right there. Uh, this was a rental, but obviously they're not renting anymore because they're closing. So I picked this up for her. El Chavo. We already watched it. She liked it, and she wanted to watch it again. So pick that up for her. 99 cents. And I also picked up this other one, which is you horror fans will recognize this is. I bought I bought this for three bucks. It's an American Werewolf in Paris. And the reason why I watched this is because I watched an American Werewolf in London. I have that one on VHS. I don't have it on DVD or Blu-ray yet. And I wanted to watch an American Werewolf in Paris. So the the whole point of me going to Hastings was to try to find this since everything was uh, being sold for cheap. And I found it. They had it. They had two copies of it. And I picked up one of them. So an American Werewolf in Paris. That's the other one I picked up. So there you go. Uh, not as good as the first one, but, uh, you know, I watched this when I was in high school. This came out when I was still in high school. Uh, hard to believe it's been that long, but time flies by. So anyway, I picked up these two titles, and I do plan on going back. So stay tuned for uh, what else I can find when I go. Uh, hopefully I can find some good deals. If not, then, you know, like I said, it just didn't work out. Uh, there's plenty of other places to find some interesting DVDs, but I still plan on going back and seeing what I can find. Uh, unfortunately, like I said, Hastings closing, one of the best stores in the area, but times change, and they're struggling to stay in business. So, unfortunately, they have to close. There you go. An American World from Paris and El Chavo Volume 3. Those are my uh, two most recent DVDs, and like I said, I'm, I plan on going back to the store. So stay tuned for that video, and uh, we'll see what I pick up next. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe down below. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.